Hey friends, welcome to the Graceology with Gwen Smith podcast. I'm Gwen Smith, and I'm really glad you're here. Each week I host two different shows, one with incredible guests and meaningful conversations, and one called A Moment of Grace, where it's just me talking to just you in a reflective devotional style to help connect those busy, bruised, and broken places to the beautiful hope of Jesus. So now I invite you to sit back and take a deep breath as I share with you a moment of grace. There was a time I would hide in the bathroom for an ounce of quiet and reprieve, an intense time when diapers drooped, binkies bobbled, and toddlers toddled all over the busy, boisterous Smith house. Well, those days are gone. Now Brad and I have three young adult children, two in college and one just married. And Brad and I are figuring out how to settle into this new season with just each other. Empty nest. I get why they call it that, but I don't think it's an empty season at all. On the contrary, it's quite full. Full of exciting dreams and complicated feelings. Full of unknowns, uncertainties, and unrest. Full of stretching, stirring, and stillness. Full of loving and letting go in the most exhilarating and exhaustingly wonderful ways. So we release, rally, and rest, knowing God goes before us even in the empty, often especially in the empty. We step into the crisp newness of today and the newness of a new year, confident that the Lord who satisfies us in the morning with his unfailing love pours comfort into souls swollen with sadness. We're thankful that our generous, faithful Father gives gobs of fresh mercy each morning and supernatural strength for each weakness. We celebrate, convinced that our everlasting God, El Olam, has a plan a master plan of hope and of a future. And it's not just for our children, but for us, for me, for my husband, for you. Psalm 90 reminds me to be mindful of God's limitless nature and grateful for every sunrise. In Psalm 90 verse 4, he wrote, For a thousand years in your sight are like a day that has just gone by, or like a watch in the night. Days and years, mornings and evenings, breaths, deaths, and generations. Each a treasure chest of minutes and moments that whisper the fleeting nature of humanity and the infinite hope of Jesus. Let's pray. Everlasting Lord, you are the source of all strength and hope and mercy that I need. Please teach me to number my days and walk in your wisdom. Establish the work of my hands today, Lord, as I celebrate the gift of now and the hope of tomorrow. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I hope you enjoyed today's moment of grace. I encourage you to read Psalm 90 today and spend some time in responsive prayer. Is there someone you know who could use a word of encouragement today? Why don't you open up your podcast app and share this episode with her? Don't forget to subscribe to the podcast so you never miss a thing. And be sure to connect with me on social media. I'm at Gwen Smith Music on every platform. And the show is at Graceology with an IE on every platform as well. Now get out there and have a beautiful, grace-filled day.